side control. Um, the hands here and they're holding their leg. So because if he's not holding his leg, I can start removing this and start attacking his arm. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna push in and then pull and rip this to the mat. I don't wanna get like this box shape with my arms here. The next thing I'm gonna do is get up on my toes, just walk my hips until I start smashing his head to the side. Now I wanna start fighting his elbow. So I'm gonna jump my arm up over his elbow and then raise his elbow up and that'll be your tap. Okay, so that's our first one. <laughs> okay, so he's grabbing the, grabbing the leg here. I'm gonna push in and then pull him rip. Okay, I'm just gonna start walking my hip around, find the elbow and then raise the elbow to finish. Okay, so it's our first finish. Second one, I come here, I use my a super point. So I get to my elbow and I put it in here. He's gonna start moving his arm. I cradle the elbow and then I wrist lock here. Okay, <laughs> he starts bending and I come back here. I come underneath. Once I'm underneath, I'm gonna switch my base. I'm just going to start walking my legs here. And start walking his, uh, walking his body up over his uh, arm and kind of pushing his arm off his back. Okay, one more time. Super point here. So I come here and this makes a move. And generally, you can get this wrist lock here. He bends this way. You can come underneath. Switch my base and start walking my legs. I guess I'll finish. He's got a tight shoulder. Yeah. It comes on really strong. Okay, so this is my first two. Next one. We go from, uh, from the mount position. If Mark starts pushing on my knee here, I'm gonna pin his wrist to the floor and he kind of makes that Kimura shape. And if he starts wriggling around and sitting up, it gives me opportunity to come underneath, kick my leg off, start running my hips, and then I do the same finish. Okay, so one more time. Mount position. Here it starts pushing on my knee, maybe putting me into side control. I'm gonna pin this. Come underneath, kick this leg off, run my hips, find the elbow, and finish. Okay, I can also sit through here and finish here. Okay, so last one. So I'm pushing on my knee. Yeah, I get this position, but his head's off the mat. So I post my head on the mat. Not the top of my head, see these bridges that go over my neck, I'll put my forehead on the mat. I'll start moving this leg around his head here, and then sit him up to his knees. I pull this tight and I finish here. If he rolls, yeah, you go keep the elbow off the floor. Keep the elbow off the floor, tripod, run up, smash his face, find the elbow, finish it the same way. Okay, so there's some killer chicken wings to you there.